I getting ourselves ready to go down to breakfast and then afterwards we're gonna go to the doll plantation which is pineapples and stuff. So it's gonna be an interesting day. What? It's pineapples and stuff. It is, pineapples and stuff. It's a plantation. It's just pineapples. It's a pineapple plantation. Anyway, it should be interesting. We're gonna get ice creams that come in pineapples and then also maybe a coconut later even though none of it's like coconuts. I feel like you kind of have to have one if you're in Hawaii, so, sorry, Hawaii? It's the law. It's the law. The law of Hawaii. So we are um, at our last breakfast and we got hot breakfast today and I'm still looking forward to this omelette and I think I'm growing on the omelette chef because he's been very silly this whole time but today I got a smile so there you go clearly you just have to force yourself onto people until they like you life lessons from Violet syrup with bacon and ketchup look at James's sea of syrup make a little wave so we can see it the entire plate is syrup. Come with me, my love, to the sea, the sea of syrup. <laughs> I want to tell you just how much I love you. Well, pick up that one. Um, we're heading to the Dole Plantation, which is a pineapple farm slash, I don't know, adventure park, I guess. There's like a hedge maze and stuff, but we're really just here oh, to yeah. eat pineapple themed ice Look, cream. the trash can's on fire. Block yeah. that. The trash can is on fire. That's good. Okay, it tastes really good. They're really melty. <laughs> well, it's whipped, so. I can't. Nice. Okay, we finished up at the doll plantation. Um, yeah, we pretty much just came here for that ice cream. Um, <laughs> there's like tours and stuff you can do, but we're running short on time. So um, now we're gonna head back to the resort pack up our stuff. Oh, we're gonna do some more beaches along the way, try to find coconut, and then just relax. Relax. So we've come down to a beach now and it has what looks like really big waves. It turns out there's some kind of surfing competition on um, and someone called John John is the world champion. So good luck John John. Beach. Go for it, go surfing. Them, but they are not looking. And then we thought Kobe was cut our eye, 
but then he just took photos of us while we were all frantically waving for them to come back. around the hotel and we tried to get some um, nice cabana area at the um, hotel pool but we couldn't find anything that wasn't shaded and they didn't have the umbrellas up so it was really windy over that side so we came back to the beach where we have our own cabana again which is nice and the weather's pretty good the boys are getting chips and drinks and we're just gonna chill here while they go off and do like you know energetic things I don't know are they, are they, Stopping and snorkeling or something. Who knows? So we got tired of the beach. The boys still wanted to go um, swimming. The surfing thing was closed because the waves are like crazy big today, so only professionals um, should be out. <laughs> Apparently, they're not professional level. So sad, right? Um, but they were really bummed out. And then the snorkel thing was closed. and. Oh, I can see them walking down the beach there together. It kind of looks like they're holding hands a little bit. So cute. So Aww. cute. Um, anyway. Um, so yeah, we're just packing up now to leave. Gonna put everything back in suitcases, which might be a little hard, but I guess we'll see how that goes. Uh, I bought this beautiful shell at the gift shop for my mom and spent ages peeling off the price label only to find underneath the price label the lovely Made in the Philippines label. Seriously, Hawaii. Really? Well, either way, it's a pretty shell and it was in Hawaii at some point. <laughs> Counts! We realized we don't have any dinner food, so now we're going back to the hotel thing for some dinner food. Okay, so our dinner tonight consists of taste of Asia Hadi pork flavored tonkatsu ramen, miso soup, and Kraft mac and cheese. Possibly. So possibly. Well, it's all possibly because, um, actually, interesting story. All of these require a microwave, um, but we don't have a microwave because it costs $25 a day, so we are going to try uh, using a kettle, <laughs> even though all of them technically require a microwave. They shouldn't require a microwave because it's just ramen, but you know, we'll see. <laughs> Wish us luck. Wish us luck, damn it. Ramen, miso, display advertising. Action shot. It's a money shot. <laughs> yep. Thank you. Okay. Looks it's been three and a half minutes. It needs a really good mix. But the noodles look cooked, so there's that. It's definitely not tonkatsu, but it's also not the worst. That is the new standard that we are going from here. <laughs> not the worst. Okay, so Easy Mac, um, it's a little bit like Easy Soup. <laughs> noodles and cheese soup. Mmm, the noodles are cooked. No, mine wasn't. The cheese is very watery. I'm gonna give that a one <laughs> because there's almost a cheese flavor. <laughs> <laughs> almost. 
So you think if you did it next time, put less hot water? Yeah, if you put like half the hot water in, I reckon it'd work fine. It's like four in the morning and we're just heading off now. We packed up all the stuff, suitcases, bags and stuff. Goodbye, Turtle Bay Resort. It's been fun. If you like this video, then chances are you'll like my others too. Subscribe to my channel, then check out my blog at violetlabo.com. There's even a super cute puppy. <laughs>